What is happening ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Battlefield 1 and you know what this video means ladies and gentlemen by either the title or the obviousness of this video I have finally got the Martini Henry sniper, eh, uh, <coughs> the Martini Henry in Battlefield 1 Yes, just yesterday I managed to achieve the status of rank 10 scout class and I feel like I have joined the master race <laughs> And the one thing I've learned in Battlefield is I've actually became quite a good sniper in my years. <laughs> That's the one thing I've learned. Because we all remember in Battlefield 4 when I attempted sniping, I couldn't hit the fucking broadside of a fucking turret. The broadside of a house, I mean. Or a barn, whatever one, whatever way you want to use the metaphor. And definitely I think I've achieved that goal. <laughs> I think now I've got better in Battlefield as a sniper. I don't think I'll continue my sniping career because... I don't know, I just, I don't enjoy sniping too much, mainly because, it's, I don't know, I like to be in the front lines as a medic, because every time I see somebody tiring about me, my instinct is to whip out my syringe and revive them, but, because I'm a sniper, I can't do that, I either whip out a fucking periscope or a flare gun, I'm just sitting there, looking at them like, I wish I could revive you mate, but I can't. Eh? That's the one thing that I like about Battlefield as well, it's just the way the game plays, like you can have moments where you're a, a say for example, a support class, right, and you're coming up against a tank and you've no assault class in that area with you and you're just basically fucked because you don't have a, a, a assault class to take out the tank. And you're like, right, I'll go the assault class, this has happened to me, you go the assault class and you basically, you go to the same spot and the tank's not there in the mirror and you're stuck with an SMG and you can't really do much. But, the one thing, back to the Martini, because I know that's pretty much why everybody's here. Martini Henry is, if you don't know what it is in real life, this is a single shot breech loading rifle from the good old uh, tea drinkers of Britain and its empire. That This gun was basically used for it by the Basically, the start of the British Empire, this thing was, I think it was this, no, it was the Brown Bess, but later on in the Empire, when about the 1800s, I think it was, uh, this black powder rifle was basically king at the time. Yeah, I don't know its exact bullet, the exact bullet it fired, but quite a powerful cartridge, just with the sound in the game, and if you watch a few videos in real life about the Martini, you'll get a bit more in-depth. If you know what a breech loader is, it is pretty much a single shot breech loader is basically fire a shot, you pull a lever, cartridge ejects, you load a new cartridge in, close the breech, and that's you ready to fire again. That's pretty much a breech loader. And the Martini Henry is quite a satisfying gun to use. It's a gun that requires you to actually look, take your time. Be patient. Although I don't do that in this video, I kinda just rush about because it was quite this was basically the first game I got the Martini Henry in. And I was screaming like a wee lassie, like, oh my god, I got the Martini, woohoo! Basically doing that. And I was pure happy, and every single kill I got, I had to record, and that's why this video has been formed. Because <laughs> every kill I got, I had to record it, because it was so satisfying. But that is why the Martini, I believe the Martini Henry is quite good, and it's quite a nice rifle to go for. Especially if you've never played it. Because as everybody knows, I'm not a sniper. I'm pretty sure if you see me in Battlefield 4 attempting to snipe, no a good thing at all. <laughs> so it's quite one of the things to get you out your comfort zone and try and go for. But that's why I'm going for other classes rank 10 so far now. We just have the support class to get to rank 10 and that is us. Sorted bef hopefully before the first DLC drops. And all that goodness. <laughs> But definitely, this is a this was probably the best clip I got with the Martini Henry. I managed to take two guys out so far. I was about to go for this well, third guy here, and we're in a wee bit of a, just a wee bit of a gunfight, not a major thing. And I done a wee bit of the nasty here and sneaked into this wee bit of the ballroom blitz here and took his head clean off. And I was quite proud of that. And his pal spawns on that roof. Then take his head clean off, and I was like, yes, I just got a fucking, I think I was a four man, I got, I was like, yes, four man with a martini. And that was 
that was basically me. I thought I was a god with a Martini Henry, but in, it, literally five minutes later, I got absolutely shat upon by a guy with a Hell Regal, and that was basically me. All happiness exited my soul and went to the ether. <laughs> Probably because I was a bit too cocky with it. And right, I don't know what I was doing there. But, that is it for the Martini Henry video. I hope you enjoyed the wee video. I hope you found it entertaining and informative, maybe. So, thank you so much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you have a good day. Keep for, Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share the video with anybody you want. Have a good day, and I will see you all in the next video. Spell!